Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton, I'm your humble narrator, as at least 700 of you may know, which is a fucking crazy big number. I just wanted to do a vlog real quick because I don't usually take the time to sit down and talk with my subscribers, let them know how I'm feeling, uh, what I'm thinking as far as the channel goes, and I think that's a mistake. I think that you guys should definitely be included because uh, you guys are the one that gives me support. You guys are the reason that I do this whole thing. So the roleplay series will definitely continue. The reviews will continue. Um, I'm thinking about including a SNES series on the channel, which uh, I'm rather looking forward to because it gives me a chance to go back to some older titles. But I'm also looking at things like The Culling and Stardew Valley. I want to start streaming... Uh, either of those on Sundays at 6 p.m. I don't have like a whole lot of time to do YouTube lately, which is super unfortunate. Um, I'm struggling to get my backlog back together. It used to be like, uh, you know, two or three weeks out there and now I'm uh, down to one week. So a little bit worried, but um, it's plenty of time to get some more stuff together and uh, hopefully the new content will be even better. I switched to Sony Vegas from Camtasia recently and really enjoying the new uh, features. I can do animations and things like that. Pokemon Top 10 list will be making a comeback and uh, the animations will probably be showcased during that. So I hope you're excited. I'm definitely excited. Fucking 700 man. Almost a thousand. This is it's just crazy. Started from zero. Started from the bottom. Now we're here. Dude. <sighs> You guys are amazing. Truly, truly. I don't take the time to sit down and tell you guys that, um, unless you leave a comment. And then I, then I gush a little bit, but uh, I hope that's a positive for you. I really do want to be able to respond to every comment, no matter how big I get. Um, hopefully it won't become too crazy. Like, I kind of like the low amount of comments that I get at the moment, even with 700 subscribers, because it, it allows me the time to, to sit down and look at each one, even when it says, like, 12 notifications. It's like, well, that's not much to go through. When it starts saying 99, then then we might have uh, a problem. But if you've been here, if you've been commenting, I know your name, then I probably won't hesitate to reply to you anytime I see your name. <laughs> but I do plan to go so much further in this YouTube thing. I'm still obviously figuring it out. Um, there's some new stuff that I want to try with the roleplay. You guys will look forward to that. Um, I did get a fellow Let's Player, Salty Stevie, to uh, do some voicing for that so I can kind of shape the story myself in a way. Um, and I think it's going to be really, really good. Going to be quite tasty. I guess it wouldn't hurt to just tell you guys some uh, some life things. That's about all I wanted to say regarding the channel. Right now I'm doing editing work. I did quit my job at the gas station, which I talked about back at like 300 subs or something like that. And uh, now I'm kind of doing one-off editing work mostly. Uh, I'll do a student film here and there, but mostly it's actor reels and things like that. So if you need that done, hit me up. Proficient in Avid, that is what I use for reels, just because uh, I understand the bins a little bit better. It fits a little better on my computer and whatnot. And it's a lot more customizable. Vegas is kind of cool. You can drag and drop, but Avid is absolutely insane as far as the customization goes. Despite the uh, new position that I have, self-employment, it, it's not all really peaches and green. Peaches and cream. <laughs> um, I enjoy it, you know, but it is a struggle. I'm making less money than I used to, so it's harder to buy games and things like this, but uh, I was able to buy Stardew Valley in the culling. I've got like an extra 50 bucks or so a month. Not enough for a triple-A title, but I can get those indie titles pumped in there, which uh, hopefully you guys will appreciate. I do like bringing these uh, smaller titles to light. I've been playing Action Hank with Squeaky Smurf and The Culling with Roulette. I plan to sit down and record something with either of them. Hopefully that will be a treat. Yeah, Playintosh has been a little bit busy. Uh, so far we've managed to keep up the Project Zomboids, keep them flowing. But uh, yeah, it's it's definitely been short notice. We kind of do it on the weekend and then I have like two or three days to edit it, which is not 
how I like to work, but it's it's what we're doing at the moment. So uh, if I miss a week or something like that, uh, don't fret. I do apologize in advance for that. Uh, I've been considering starting a, a Zomboid series of my own, but I have not done so. Playing Tosh says it would be all right. I just haven't done it because uh, it might be a little bit confusing. You know what I mean? Unless I do like a completely different thumbnail, but that's also something that I want to work on. Channel art and things like this. My thumbnails have been relatively generic since I started, and uh, I haven't done much to change them. So I'm going to try and find uh, a unique style, somewhat of a, a channel makeover, in a way. Content will probably be relatively the same, but um, I want to step it up, you know? 700 subs is a huge number, and I feel like I've got to... <laughs> gotta keep it up, you know? There's way bigger channels that you guys could be watching, but you guys decide to come and watch mine, which is extremely, extremely humbling, and <laughs> tearing up. And I just want to do the best that I can for you guys, you know? Um, this is a big part of my life. <laughs> I put so much time and so much effort and to see, fuck, and to see it, like, coming and bearing fruit, you know, tiny fruits right now, but it is fruit. And it's fucking crazy, you know, that people encourage me and watch me and want me to continue. So, I just wanted to say thanks. A lot, a lot. I'm really sorry for breaking down. I didn't expect to. Ah, <sighs> fuck. But you guys are amazing. And... Thank you so much for, for holding me up, and, you know, this is this is really a creative release for me, and although I'd probably continue if there weren't people watching, um, I'm really glad that there are, so I just, <sighs> thank you guys so much, you know? I thought about doing, um, some vlogs or something like that, um, you know, this Tommy NC thing came out, uh, did you hear about that? Leafy made a video. Leafy is here made a video about a fedora-wearing dude named Tommy NC2010 uh, saving eggs from on top of this lady's car, and then he stops her and, like, interviews her about it. Um, and I thought the video was fucking hilarious, and I wanted to do a video like that. And then it comes out that Tommy NC has autism, which is, you know, something that somebody can't help. I'm sure I have a light form of autism to sit here in front of a fucking computer all day. <laughs> and, like, it... It broke me up, you know? The fact that I would even consider something like that is... It's not what Dayton Does is about, you know? I want to be the one to uh, to spread positivity, you know? I don't want to hurt anybody. That's why I just kind of stay in my little bubble, stick to video game reviews and uh, movie movie commentaries, things like that. I'd really like to get back into that, too. Um, so far, there's only one episode in mucking with movies, fucking with films, um, but I have a, a Silence of the Lambs planned episode, I just hope that it doesn't get me a copyright strike, but, um, I'll deal with that as it comes, I suppose, <sighs> good lord, so, um, yeah, that's about all I wanted to say, um, really sorry for breaking down, Dayton will, uh, continue to bring the positive vibes, <laughs> as it were, uh, I don't get involved in YouTube drama, you know, I think that's one thing that kind of, uh, brings people to my channel, but not getting involved in drama does not mean not being personable or not letting people know what's going on in your life. So, I want to be as real as possible. <laughs> I'm not going to cry again. Um, and I just thank you guys. 703 now. 704. God damn it. It's just insane. You guys are the best. Thank you so much for supporting Dayton Does. I will be here for a long time to come, and uh, I hope you guys will enjoy the content. Don't hesitate to leave a comment if you uh, feel something fell a little bit short. I might have cried here, but that's because my heart was getting big. I don't cry uh, out of anger or getting my feelings hurt. So I take on criticism pretty well, I think. Uh, so leave some for me and see it go into action, although probably two or three weeks later than you left it. So I've been Dayton Does, Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I hope that you guys will stick around, see what comes next. We got a lot of uh, craziness planned. No more puking in buckets. 
If you don't know what I'm talking about, Neurovoid or Halloween special. Go look that up. I'll see you in the next one, friends. Don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you enjoyed my tears. <laughs> and until the next time, bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.